Hey guys, welcome to today's video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the new leak that Lama Train Studio um, tweeted out yesterday, April the 16th, on Twitter. Before we start talking everything, make sure you guys like and subscribe, or to click that bell and set on the notification time when we go live. We're doing it on my channel if you have no case sent to you. Alright, so about yesterday, around 6 19 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Lama Train Studio tweeted out the following tweet with the caption saying, Stepping on the Beach. That's literally what the caption is, there's nothing else there. And then with the caption, there is a video which will be on screen where I'm talking about this. So, in the video, there's a lot of things to talk about. There are a lot of things I'm going to talk about and everything. So, the first thing that you see is obviously three people there. So, you see, first of all, you see two MPs pass, pa um, passing around a wolf theme ball. So, for example, this is a poof theme ball. And then, in, like, in the comments, some people said, like, our mentee said in, in the comments, he said, doesn't... Puff have Spice Hardy, um, Kaji playing with a Puff, and then also inside that that um comment, someone commented on that comment as well and said, "Pretty sure that's a Puff design volleyball." NPCs might talk about it since they cannot play with a Puff, so stuff like that. So people were thinking that oh, just they're just throwing a, around like a dead Puff or a Puff in general. And people are thinking like that because you can see you can kind of see its mouth and you can see it's like head where it's like you know blue and white so it might just be like a pool wolf theme you know wild blonde and stuff like that so you can see the two npcs like i said you can see the white man or a white kid rather in um blue um shorts you can see the the black lady in um you know purple and white dress and you can see the girl in the back with a red um red um dress or a red you know clothing and you can see her with the um purple you know um purple um, dyed here or here in general. Then, not only do you see that, if you look behind Lando, there is a new Lumion to be spotted. All right, there is a new Lumion to be spotted. And what Lumion is that? There is no name. All we know is that this is, this is the exact same thing that happened with Guppy when there was a Gamma Guppy or something that like, you know, when, the, when there was a robot Guppy in the um, robot um, leak, it was right next to Lando, the same thing like this. So this is a type of Shark Lumion, as you can see, you can see it's like, it's fin, or I don't know what they call it, I think it's called a fin or something like that, on its like, you know, its um head or something like on the upper part. And then you can see at the back, there's like a propeller or something spinning behind it. You know, trying to keep it, you know, up. And you can see it kind of like move up a little bit. You can see it's one of his arms moving up and down and stuff like that. So you can see his eyes, you know. You can see, you can see his eyes, like it has like a kind of glowy feeling to it and stuff like that. You can, see, you can see his other arm where it has like this kind of design. Like, it's like, it looks like a tabular to me in a kind of way. Because you can see a tabular, like the tape button. You can see like the part where it curves open to cut the tape. It kind of looks like, it kind of like that shape to me. So he has like a big hand. And then you can kind of see like maybe um you can kind of if you scroll in and you look closer you can kind of see like something sharp like three sharp thingies on his hand like maybe like thing that used to cut it maybe there's like a ro rotating thing that used to cut it and it will cut like something maybe like maybe they're just like a move cut cut and it cut something so like it kind of have that kind of feeling to me because it's bad as well so what people people have majority of people have made theories about this Lumion saying it's this very type of it is the um very types of of Lumion, like what type is a Lumion? Like there's various types of it, what well, it could be. First of all, a shark is a, a fish or an animal that lives in the water, all right? So when you look at that, you can assume that, okay, this might be water type because in the water. But if you look at this body, it doesn't really look like a shark. It actually looks like, you know, it kind of looks metallic. Then like a shark. So you can kind of infer when you look at it, you can kind of see that, okay, this is not a shark. It's probably like a metal, you know, shark that goes inside. This kind of reminds me of what's that metal shark in Pokemon? I can't remember. There's a metal shark in Pokemon or something like that. Or just a metal shark somewhere where it goes into the water. So it kind of reminds you, you know, of, you know, a, a, a metal. So it kind of looks like metallic. So you can assume it's either, either metal or and water because it's a shark type, but because it can't be water, you know, it, it wouldn't make sense for it to be water, you know, because it's metallic. And also, the propeller at the back, which is spinning, you know, is what keeps it alive. Like, for example, um, how does that spin? Goppy floats. There's no, there's no flying mechanism what keeps it holding and staying up. It just floats in the air. That's what it just has, it just has psychic power. It just floats in the air. So, same thing like, um, Gold, Godin from Pokemon. It just floats in the air. Magic Carp, it just floats in the air majority of the time. Well, Magic Carp is a whole different um, situation. Magic Carp flops around. 
for Godin, it just floats in the air. Like, nothing's happening. Like, what is going on? It just floats in the air like that. It's not like Magic Card that has to go, you know, that has to go Marty Carp Carp and all that. So, you know, you can you can infer that because, you know, you see the propellers, that's what's holding it up. Making it being a type of, you know, air type because it has a propeller. And then because of the metallic body and stuff like that, you can see his arm, like the arm is not, you know, normal. It's like kind of metallic. So you kind of assume that, you know, that's a metallic lumen. So people have said that it's like kind of like metal or air or metal and water. But I don't think it should be metal and water because it's sharp. Why would it be metal and water? It can just be like metal and air because the propeller is what's holding it up. So it has to be something air. Air has probably has to be there somewhere because the propeller is holding it up and that's what the Lumia is made out of and that's what it's based up. Then if you look in the background, I don't know if you guys saw it, but if you look in the background, the background rock, I don't know if you guys saw it, but this rock kind of looks like a plane. It kind of looks like a plane wing, like the back of it, like the back wing, or I don't know what it's called, the back thing. Like there's like, you know, it has the wings and at the back, they're just type of like, you know, thingy that stays at the back. And so I can't remember what it's called, but it's like kind of wing at the back that goes, that, that, that has like a curve shape for that. And that rock, to be honest, it kind of looks like that to me. I, I don't know why I just noticed this now, but as I'm looking at it, it kind of looks like a kind of, you know, the back of the plane where it has that tail thingy at the back. So it kind of looks like that. And if you look in the back, if you look at the tennis, um, the tennis thing, if you zoom in real good, you kind of see there's a Lumion, the Lumi disc sign on there, or the Lumi, yeah, the Lumi disc sign. If you scroll in like really good, you can kind of see Lumi disc sign on it, but if you like, if you look back, you can kind of see it as well, but it's not as clear. So there's also that, if you didn't see that as well, the Lumi disc, um, you know, logo thing on there as well. And then in the background, if you zoom in, zoom in, you can see these kind of air, air socket things in the ground. For example, you know, these air socket things, well, first of all, it could be an NC net because in one, in like in, in Guild Ford, there's one person who said that, like a trainer who said that you shouldn't run to NC nets or stuff like that. But I think that is not NC net. It kind of looks like a kind of NC net because, you know, it's like, kind of, it looks like kind of ant nest in, you know, it sounds like an ant nest. But at the same time, air is flowing through it like that, so it couldn't. It, it might not be an ant, ant nest as well and stuff like that. So, with this thing, you kind of you can kind of infer that maybe that would be another place where we can hop up and get up to there because you can see in the back, like it, it has to be something that we can you know we can use to hop up because there is one place on route. Two, I think it's route two that you can access that place and get like a TM or something like that, something like that up there. And maybe this will, maybe maybe there will be something like that where we can also get up there as well. And I want to point out one more thing. If you look behind, if you look at the girl, the girl who is standing, um, who is who is watching the NPCs play. And then if you look, if you look beside that, there's a chair, right? Like a tight a, a high chair. And then if you look behind that high chair, there's a tree, there's a palm tree or something like that in preacher. And if you look at the right side of it, you can kind of see something blue. If you look up, like right before it cuts off the screen you can see like there's a blue thing or like a a i don't know what color that is and to me i was like a kind of door or a root entrance for example when you go to root when you, when you go to each root there's a root gate it kind of had a gate to me like a gate reveal i'm not sure i'm not 100 percent sure but you can we can kind of infer because it kind of looks like it kind of looks like you know the blue part kind of like a gate entrance you kind of infer that it might be a gate entry and stuff like that. So, this is basically all I have for this. If you have any theories or anything you want to let me know, like, okay, it could be this, it could be that. Let me know down in the comments because this is amazing. The only thing that fascinates me about me is because, first of all, the volleyball is, is kind of cool in a way. I like the animation, like how they animated that. And I hope, like, maybe when we go into that route, we'll be able to, like, you know, interact with the NPCs or, be, they, or maybe, like, we interact with them and they'll be like, Hey, I'm playing the game. Stop bothering me or something like that. Or, you, or when you're going past and towards the route, you can just see them, you know, stuff like that. And I think that girl in the background with the red thing is like a, it's like a lifeguard. That's what they wear because she's like right next to the seat, so she could be a lifeguard and stuff like that. And I hope like maybe in the route we're able to see stuff like that where we we'll see this NPC just playing together and you know and stuff like that. You can also see the the shark as well. The shark, will be here. of course, you're probably gonna encounter it in the wild. I'm not sure if you encounter it in the water, but maybe like grasses near the water. You can see some grasses, you know, grasses patch over there in like on the on the grass area. Like you can see some grasses patches over there. But I'm not sure if you actually encounter this in water. This has propeller, and you know, you know, in the propeller, the water will actually mess up. You know, the, the water actually messes the propeller. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. Let me know what your theories and your thoughts about this new leak or this new teaser 
about uh, the next um, the next area after a just let me know what you think in the comment and yeah so like I like, like I said in the beginning of the video make sure you like and subscribe click that bell and set to all notifications same time when I go live or do it to my channel you will have no kids sent to your device and yeah thank you guys for watching I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next video bye bye